to be honest, I don't remember the first artwork I ever created. I think the earliest piece or the earliest memory that I have might be a piece that my mother did out of my drawings. Like a, it was like a screen print on fabric and it still hangs in our house on the wall. أقول أسمع إيش ده؟ I think within my work I use a lot of signs and symbols and information that carries a lot of context. So a lot of the found footage that I use are found footage that has gone viral that a lot of people have seen and have different experiences with. <laughs> To me, a work that's very pivotal within my practice is Tlini Warwar. Because prior to that, I was working a lot on um, prints, and then I started printing on fabric, and then I wanted to animate the prints and kind of bring them to life, and that pushed me into the world of moving image. And through that, works such as self-portrait as a pomegranate, هيلا يا رمانة هيلا يا رمانة والحلوة زعلانة And those who don't know falcons grill them And I started to work with performers and works such as I was told ice would melt in heat It's funny because that piece is the, the longest piece that I've ever created. It's around five to six hours long. I feel like my work has always been within the digital realm. So I've always kind of leaned towards using mediums that are easily distributed. NFTs are very new to me and I'm trying to make sense of them and understand them and see where my work is placed within all of that and what it means for my work to be placed within within that world. The more they love you, the harder they will run for you on the day of the race. Obviously, culture is kind of constantly evolving um, through different mediums and platforms. And the way that is influenced on to tradition is kind of a choice that we have. Uh, so what we take, what we let go of, what, what we move forward with, um, it's super interesting to see. And I think a lot of my work as a whole really speaks about that and questions that. And it's, it's something that I'm just watching over and kind of studying from afar.